So, Korea take on New Zealand in this important game for both camps. Important for Korea because they went down 3-2 on the opening day. And important for New Zealand as they look to keep their 100% record, having beaten Belgium by four goals to three on Saturday. Here is Glynn, trying to work the space there, just crowded out of things. Glynn coming back into the team after injury. Good shot, fine save there. Knocked away by Suji Yang. Game needs a goal, Sarah. Yeah, needs something, doesn't it? Started off pretty well. We might get one here. What an opportunity here for Korea. Shot comes in again, straight at the goalkeeper. We just made doubly sure those pads were locked together there. That was Dare Kim played in. Yeah. Rather tame finish in the end. Well, three points available for the win in these games. It's quite clear from what we've seen in the first half an hour or so. Those uh, points have been very hard won here. Oh! <laughs> it's gone in. It seemed to wrap around the frame of the goal, but what a finish there for Korea. No defending that one at all. Cox gets it into the circle, Whitelock goes for a goal, got a good shot away. Now punt on the reverse stick side. Just uh, looping a shot towards goal, but the goalkeeper always favourite to keep that one out, Suji Jang. Punt takes it on and fires it wide. Well, that's rather wasted. I need to punt there, having a go with a drag flick from the top of the circle. Quite wide. More problems here, very nearly a second goal, and that would have settled the uh, issue for sure. Seemed a certain goal there, Kim couldn't quite lay a stick on it. Korea have beaten New Zealand by the only goal in the game. It's finished Korea 1, New Zealand 0. The goal scorer, Dare Kim for Korea.